Hi guys, welcome back to the Tamam Show. It's a Shilla here. If you're new here, thank you so much for clicking on the video. And if you're a returning subscriber, hey, how are you doing? <laughs> okay, today, really quick video. I just thought I'd make a really short video talking about the Tarte Cosmetics Maracuja Juicy Lip Plump balms i think that's what they are they're lip balms like i would say so i got three shades i i've had this for a while so the packaging gone in the bin um i have two of them which are plumping they have this kind of rose gold packaging and then the other isn't plump plumping has just like peach pinky packaging so yeah i just thought i'd swatch them on and tell you guys what i think about them again some of my first impressions because i've been using these for a couple of maybe a month now i think i got them in december so i haven't used them for a while i know exactly how i feel about them it's just for you guys to see so uh, i'm gonna start off with the non-plumping one which is this which is in the shade grapefruit so the first thing i'm gonna do is i'm gonna swatch it on my i'm gonna swatch it on the back of my hand then i'm gonna swatch it on my lips and then i will swatch it on my lips again with my chosen lip liner so this is what it looks like in the little this one sorry i'm just using my thingy to make sure this is actually in frame but this is what it looks like in the tube uh the packaging is super messy you don't want to so you just click here to push stuff out you don't want to like push too much out because then yeah it's wasted just push a little out at a time that's i do like maybe two clicks sometimes maybe sometimes no clicks because it's usually still messy and has like a lot of products on it so it is what it is so this is the shade grapefruit and this is what it looks like at the back of my hand it is quite a nice pinky color i'm gonna say like this is actually one of my favorite ones of the three that i got i, I wish i got the plumping version of this like i wish i got a grapefruit in the plumping version if they have it i can't really remember if they do. so i just put it on my lips With this product you can build up a little it doesn't really get super opaque but you can apply more to you can apply more just to like get more color payoff so this is what it looks like without any liner it's very comfortable on my lips and yeah just I don't have any problems with it. It's a super cute color. It's very comfortable on the lips. I really don't have any problems with this product except for the packaging. If the packaging was different, I would be over the moon. But the packaging, I know they were trying to do something with the clicky bottom and ooh. Okay, so it turns out that I just recorded all of that without my mic actually placed on my chest. Like it's plugged into my phone, so I thought. It was on me but it was just dangling and i hope to god that um <laughs> that it picks up my voice amazingly and i don't have to refilm this because that would be awkward for me i don't need that right now i don't need that so for today for all my lip looks i'm going to be using the same lip liner and i have picked the rare beauty liner and it's age strong so yeah i'm gonna go with i hate i hate when the caps of pencils can't fit at the bottom of it because i'm just like that is a that is a a great way to make me lose the cap like just make it fit anyway <laughs> rant over just gonna line my lips and then try it on Okay, so my lips are lined. I kind of just fast forward it through that process because I don't feel like I lined my lips in any way special. But if you guys want me to actually post the video of how I line my lips, then let me know and I'll do that. Today, I have actually overlined my lips a little. Not something I typically do, if I'm being honest, but you know, I just, today, it was just, I was just feeling like that. So, anyways, this is not about my lip lining, this is about the. The lip gloss, the lip balm, shall I say. Okay, so this is what Grapefruit looks like with some liner. I think that 
the liner definitely elevates her takes her to like a whole new world a whole new place and she just looks you know extra scrum deli ish scrum deli you know like just just a little bit a little bit more mm. <laughs> so on to the next shade which is the shade honeysuckle so honeysuckle is essentially this kind of brown color it's probably the most like viral like trendy one that everyone knows about and everyone's raving about so everyone's probably heard of this one personally i don't feel like of the three that i got i just feel like it's not my favorite one like it's nice but it's not that nice like it's 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 okay <laughs> i don't have to explain it it's just okay so i'm just gonna try it on without any lip liner this version has like a plumping effect it's not like a crazy amount of like stinging it's very like um tolerable 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 yeah it's a pain it's a amount of pain you can tolerate okay so this is the shade honeysuckle without any lip liner i have to say this is my favorite way to wear the shade okay so let's try the shade honeysuckle with some lip liner on i feel like i look a bit cartoony with my lips this of a line but i'm just trying to keep it consistent um yeah guys i know that i said that i don't like this color with lip liner on but this looks good <laughs> the pinkness of my lips is still like are still like peeking through in the lip combo which is nice but yeah no she's cute she's cute like what you guys saying we're almost at the finish line last but definitely not the least shade cherry blossom so this is what the shade looks like oh my god i completely forgot to swatch this at the back of my hand okay so this is all three top to bottom so from top to bottom we have grapefruit honeysuckle and then cherry blossom cherry blossom is probably the one shade that i was a bit apprehensive about like i was like mm, not gonna like her but I actually really do. Again, she's very wearable. This is a shade Cherry Blossom without any lip liner on. This is also like a pink shade, but it's more of like a baby pink. I'll tell you guys right now, right here, I wouldn't wear this without a lip liner. I don't particularly like this look. I just think that it's a little milky on my lips and it just takes away from the beauty <laughs> so i'm just gonna go ahead and put on some lip liner and then i'm gonna show you guys how magical she can really look you know you know what i mean yeah okay so lip lines let's do this if this shade was a gloss i would definitely use it more as like a topper for my lip combos and i feel like that's why i said that it's one of the shades i wouldn't wear on its own but 100 percent with a combo with a combo yeah also not so much and this is what the shade cherry blossom looks like with lip liner on and i'm just gonna <laughs> i was eating cherries and i just realized this is cherry blossom so we're gonna have to do a little photo shoot like tart cosmetics shoot um add me to the pr Mm-hmm. He says, I think I'm killing it. <laughs> Alright guys, so that's the end of my video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. Let me know what shade was your favorite. I'll see you guys next time. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Help your girl out. We're trying to get monetized this year. This is the year to get monetized, okay? So please, 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 please. Makeup is not cheap. <laughs> makeup ain't cheap. I ain't joking. Makeup makeup is expensive. Um, so yeah, just please. I'm begging you. <laughs> like i am not trying to flex no more i'm just gonna beg y'all so don't if you're watching this and you're not subscribed i know you're not subscribed because i can see the analytics i can see the analytics what yeah so please 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 subscribe <laughs>